<laughs> oh. oh, you get a gong. Oh, wow. Oh, this is going to be epic. Wow. Hey, welcome back to Ping Pong Flicks. My name is Chris Wong. Call Skull Island is coming out real soon. I mean, less than three weeks. March 10th, Kong Skull Island blows open the monster first with Godzilla, King Kong, Rodan, King Ghidorah, Nami, nah, Hopeful, for all the other ones, but Kong and Godzilla for sure. Now, this came out Warner Japan teases Kong Skull Island stats, and this picture is awesome. It's just the it's so majestic even though it's kind of like oh man uh, those guys in that helicopter are dead <laughs> but you see him it's huge I think that's Brie Larson all the way on the bottom could be wrong but he looks big but get this he's just a kid he's just a young uh, big giant ape um, and apparently According to Warner Japan, his parents were killed by more than likely larger skull crawlers in the creature's backstory. Uh, that's very interesting. Uh, very much so. It almost feels much more. You feel a lot of empathy for Kong. I mean, he's the last of his kind. His folks were killed. He's almost. This is. I'm. This is turning out to be this Kong is Batman. <laughs> He is the Batman of this monster verse here. He is gonna kick major butt. But because he's a king, kid, sorry, he's a king, he's a kid, he is 31.6 meters. Now, 31.6 meters, what the heck is that? So I went ahead and I went looked up meters to feet because that's how we say it in America. <laughs> but it's about a hundred feet so I'm like thinking well it's a hundred feet you know I thought Godzilla was bigger than that and sure enough you go back and look at Godzilla 2014 stance he is 350 feet over three times Kong size but that's okay because Kong Skull Island is a kid and that means he's gonna grow bigger how do I don't know how old this Kong is but if he's like the young Bruce Wayne after his parents got shot, he's going to grow up pretty big. Enough to contend with Godzilla, at least. And that spot, oh my god, that spot with Kong fighting the skull crawlers is so cool it's so awesome anything we can watch kaiju fights in action is uh is is quite a joy and you know he's probably gonna get a really get up into godzilla's face just looking at how nimble he is how he uses tools like the boulder uh, a boulder to to hit him and and trees or buildings you know godzilla could do that too of course but if it's anything like Godzilla 19 King King, uh, King Kong versus Godzilla 1962, Kong could actually withstand some radioactive uh, fire on him, radioactive breath on him, and it, it's uh, it, he could just shake it off, and he's still okay. So if he could has that resistance. Uh, when he gets older, then definitely Godzilla's going to have a bit of a problem on his hands here. But if it is, man, it's shaping up. If you like Batman v Superman, this is starting to really shape up. Like Kong versus Godzilla, Dawn of Kaiju. Or, I don't know, Dawn of Monsters. I don't know what you call it. Dawn of King of Monsters. Whatever you want to call it. But, but it just seems so cool. Uh, uh, it actually makes it a lot more special to me because I love both properties. And it, it just seems like it. He, oh my God. Kong is Bruce Wayne, Batman of the Monsterverse. And Godzilla is Superman. Perfect. Perfect. Um, but we're going to see what it, I can't wait to see this movie because 
it's just a setup you know when i'm watching this movie it's not one movie and i think for, for a lot of people kaiju fans like you yourself who's, whoever's watching this uh if you're a huge godzilla fan there's only one thing gonna be in our minds like what's the end scene? what's the end after credit scene and what what is this like what is the potential of how this guy will f meet godzilla that's all i'm thinking about. i'm thinking about the future <laughs> i'm thinking all in the future i mean what if Godzilla is related to skull crawlers, right? Maybe I don't know. Maybe it's a maybe Godzilla was once a form of a skull crawler mutated into Godzilla, and that's why Kong wants to fight him because he has a personal vendetta against skull crawlers. Obviously, they killed his parents. He's coming back for vengeance. It adds a lot more emotional depth to a monster, and that's what we love, and that's why I can't wait for it, man. But Kong, Skull Island. March 10th, let's do this, let's do this, I can't wait, can't wait, awesome, and that's it, that's it for tonight, thank you for watching, uh, see you next time.